Next, let's look at some of the loop output devices. First is the dual relay module. Again, you'll notice when we expand the dual relay, there's a common address and two sub addresses. When we go into the settings for the common address, you'll see that there's very little configuration, just the location text and the zone information. When we go into the settings of the sub address, now you'll see we have the configure output settings. The first thing you'll notice in configure output settings are the general event categories. We can choose which general events we want to activate this output, or we can choose to program them later with cause and effect. We can choose whether or not we want this output to be silenceable. We also have first delay and second delay options. And at the bottom with all of our inputs and outputs, our location text and our zone information. When we look at relay two, you'll see it's exactly the same. 